Hello again, everyone. Welcome back to Tactics Ogre. Almost forgot what game I was playing for a second. Thank you for coming to our eight rescue old. Sorry to make your make you worry, presence. I was attacked by surprise. I've lost the valiant warriors Duke Ronway gave me to command. I cannot face him. It is still fortunate that we did not lose you or Puma Man, Leonard. Nibus does not fear the gods. Curse him! Ah, I heard Nibus is hiding in an abandoned fort close by. He abandoned Amorica and never went back to Koratani. I don't know what he's up to. Whatever he is up to. We have to kill him, or else I can never face Duke Ronway again. Can't go directly to the fort with your army? I think we should go back to the castle at once. I would if we were the only troops left, but now we have new friends. But there is no guarantee that Amorica will be safe. I owe my life to Ald. So this is your call. That's a good idea. To the fort or back to the castle, Ald? Tell us what you think. Volto, Sarah, do you agree? We will obey your command. Alright, uh, well, let's uh, go ahead and swap to a different uh, slot. We will risk our lives for you. Oh. I thought that was going to give me an option, but it doesn't. Okay, so we get our first archer. Uh, she's got a, uh, a mini blade, uh, basically just a dagger, a short bow, leather armor, and battle boots. Would you like Sarah to join your army? Yes, since she's already an archer. She's level 5. Voltel, a knight, our first knight. He has a short sword, a uh, tower shield, battle boots, leather armor. Let's go ahead and let him join. And Presence, the exorcist. He has exorcism and heal. Uh, our first uh, healing type character. If he died in the previous battle, um, then you'd get Felicia the Cleric, who has all the same items, but no exorcism, because only exorcists can use exorcism. So you really, really, really want Donald here. Oh yeah, I'm letting him join. Alright, so we've got uh, um, Fort Katariga there. Um, we've got Kizar City. Uh, let's go ahead and shop. See if they have any new things available. Uh, leather hats, nothing new here, but I do want to get one of these. Actually, two. That's good. Uh, do I need anything else? No, I suppose not. So, uh, we've got a leaf which will recover strength. Recovers hit points by 50 points. Uh, let's actually get 10 more of those. Eh, 12. 1800 goth, yeah, that's fine. That way we have a good supply. Uh, so, Magi Leaf, a medical leaf which will boost mental power, cover MP by 25 points. Um, Life Rock, a medicine made from a chimera's tail and a white dragon's fang. It can return a stoned body to normal. Uh, Antidote, a combined medicinal grass, cures poison. Ambrosia, a mixed fruit zen... A mixed fruit zena wine with yak's milk. Heals a paralyzed body. Arise, a wine with pickled Zoria flowers. It will awaken a sleeping being. Um, these, on a, this one might be worthwhile. I am not sure if petrified people uh, stay petrified, um, meaning that they're lost for good, uh, or if it uh, wears off after a time. But uh, poison wears off, stun wears off, sleep wears off. They're not. I mean, poison damages you over time, but if you can keep ke uh, healing them, then it's fine. So, none of those other things are really worthwhile, and you have to equip them as an item. You only have four item slots, so it's eh, not really worthwhile as far as I'm concerned. Um, I don't think we need anything else for now. Uh, Spell-wise, we've got Ion Shot available, Fire Burn, Acid, and Ice Blast. Um should probably go check to see what our uh, our ghost is. Uh, let's see, we can recruit. 
We can recruit lizard men here. A lizard man who can go both on ground and water has coarse scales, and its fighting ability are as high as a knight. Um, so you cannot auction lizard men. They function basically like soldiers in Amazons that they just can't change classes. And you can see that I'm already at 16 units out of a max of 30, so not really going to be uh, um, recruiting anymore. The only possibility is that if uh, I might... It, there's a slight chance, very slight chance, that I'll turn some of our uh, current troops... Uh, I'll, I'll ditch them and re-recruit as a new person um, with the hopes of uh, getting a different race so that I can get them their opinion of us higher. Um, but that's not terribly likely. Uh, let's see... So... Recruiting here would uh, get us uh, uh, Walstanian, so I'm not that interested. And that lizard man would probably be uh, uh, Walstanian. Um, so we'll go to the map for now. Alright, let's uh, take a look at our uh, new troops. So we've got Lion's Ghost, he's Water Element. Um, Let's see if I can buy him uh, um, the spell. Uh, just one. One Ice Blast. There we go. So there's no uh, no class change for him. Unable to change. That's fine. Magic. Uh, let's go ahead and equip. So we can only equip two spells. We could equip Fireburn, um, which I suppose would be good to equip on him if we go into one of the... Uh, if we do some training on a map with uh, um, treasure underneath the grass. Uh, I'll keep that in mind. Uh, but let's go ahead and give him Ice Blast for now, uh, since he is Water Element, and that should help him. Um, Item-wise... Oh, I got a Power Gauntlet. One hand defense item. I guess this is, a, this is equipped on someone. Whoever wears one will get a boost in attack power. Uh, strength plus five. Well, that's pretty nice. And Flanka. A direct attack weapon, an axe. It is not as powerful as expected, but very easy to use. Uh, weight plus 8, strength plus 16, versus... What is this? Uh, strength plus 12. And strength plus 15. Dang it. Ah. Yeah, so it's slightly better than uh, uh, the short sword. Uh, it is one-handed. Ah, Cedar Staff, that's what I want. Um, what do I want to put here? Well, I guess I'll uh, give him a cure for now. He can always use that on someone. And so we've got uh, Sarah here. Um... Okay, I can't give her a short sword. Uh, Voltel there. The knight. Presence, the exorcist. Um, rather than... Let's see. Rather than that... Let's give him the other cedar. So his uh, magic ability goes up to 90. Uh, and, he and his weight actually goes down. So he should be... He is... Whoa, 522. He is quite zippy. Um, and we've got Leonard. He's got a flanka, chain armor, uh, power wrist, power glove, whatever. It's power. Yes, it's definitely the power glove. The Nintendo power glove. This is from the Duke. I can't give it up. This is from the Duke. I can't give it up. If you're worried about me, just leave me here. That is my mother's legacy. I, I don't want to give it up. You can actually uh, uh, remove his stuff, but you can't get this. 
probably give him his stuff back. There we go. Alright, so that's about it for now, I suppose. Um, I don't think anyone can change... Oh! Some people can change classes. Maybe. Uh, so there's Knight. There's Beast Tamer. There's Ninja. And, of course, Exorcist. Um, none of you can change anything. Ah, and there's uh, Archer and Cleric. Okay, that probably means that... Uh... Yeah, alright. The, uh, the new people are the ones who can... Yeah, so Sarah could become um, a Cleric or an Amazon. Uh, but I'll leave her as an Archer. Uh, Voltel... Huh. Ah, I guess it's Leonard. He could become one of these. I don't know if you could actually change him. Eh, I'm not going to. Alright, so, um... We've quote-unquote unlocked those classes. Uh, you can see that I'm still level 2. Um, Vice and uh, Kashua are still level 3, but uh, Leonard is level 6. Mm, I think I'm going to save it here. We'll try this battle. I'm not sure if we uh, are powerful enough yet to do it. Go ahead and save it. We can give it a shot, though. Nothing wrong with that. Uh, let's check the Warren report before we do anything else. Uh, news. Rescue Leonard. Leonard was chasing Nibus when he fell into the enemy's trap at the town of Kazar. Uh, character. I don't think it's going to put the... Yeah, it doesn't put them in any different uh, colors, which is unfortunate. Uh, I know Sarah and Voltel have uh, um, character descriptions in um, the PSP version, uh, but they do not in this game. Uh, Knight Leonard. Oh, no, we actually uh, have read this. Oh, that, does, that looks new. He will... Dissect the situation carefully and make very logical decisions even when faced with adversity. Let's check to see if there was anything else. He's not swayed by... His mother was killed by the Gargastons. He's not swayed by his emotions. It does look new. Alright, there's nothing new there. But we've got Father Presence. Donald Presence, yes! He is Donald Pleasance. It is a reference to Donald Pre Pleasance. So we can keep he hearing him talk about the Puma Man. 52 years old, a Walsta Liberation Army priest, Walstanian. A priest of the Philaha religious order. He was running an orphanage at a church in Amorica, but it was set on fire by the Gargastons during the war. He lost everything and has vowed to take revenge on the enemy. And that's about it there. Miscellaneous. Um... So we've got some new things. Uh, Krizar's occupied. The town of Krizar, which is located in a remote region of Amorica, is known as the center of the Basque religion and is now occupied by the Walsta Liberation Army. It is a town where only skeletons can be seen. It is only a matter of time before the town becomes alive again. Well, that's good, I suppose. The Koratan, the Koratan Massacre. A big anti gargaston government... Big anti-Gargaston government group, I assume, assembled in the Koratani region. It is said that the assembly was held after they heard that Amorica Castle fell to the hands of the Walsta Liberation Army. The Gargaston army is stationed mostly on the Koratani re in the Koratani region. The news seemed to agitate the already existing anti-government and anti-Barbatos people in Gargaston. The Gargaston government responded by using military force, and the assembly and the assembly resulted in a bloody massacre. Oh, that's lovely. Assassin identified. Assassin identified is as follows. The man suspects the oh, the main suspects who attacked the parade in Heim on the first day of Dragon God Month have been captured. The captured guerrillas say said that they are with the Valerian Liberation Army, but the name is not 
not been made public. The Valerian Liberation Army is an extreme right-wing group who believe in the late King Dolgare's ethnic unity politics. That doesn't sound like a right-wing group to me. It sounds like a left-wing group. Nibus Missing. Nibus Ober... Obderhode, a famous necromancer and supervisor of Amorica Castle, sent by the Gargaston army, is missing. He was last seen when Amorica Castle fell to the Walsh Liberation Army. There was a high pos possibility that he was captured. Or, well, we know that that's not the case. Alright, well, um... Let's go ahead and try this. This is going to be a kind of a tough battle, but, uh... Let's double check to see if there's anything else that we want to buy first. Actually, you know what? Before I do that, let me uh, check the map to see what uh, what we're looking at in terms of buried treasure. Alright, there's... oops. Wrong button. There we go. Alright, um... where is... Fort Catariga on my list of maps here? There it is. Alright, so there is a treasure that we could find by Bernie. Um, so we might want to try for that. Uh, which means... The fire spell will not be as effective, uh, or Lion's fire spell will not be as effective. Um, but I think it's worth it. So you got up to three slots. Um, some classes will have only one, some classes will have two, and some classes will have three. Um, let's go ahead and replace that. Get fire burn. And let's go. Fight, Fight it out. All right. Who do we want to take? Um... Let's start with the back. Well, we, we're definitely going to want to take um, our new characters. Uh, we want presence, Donald. Uh, let's go ahead and take Voltel. Uh, let me put all back there since he's low level. Uh, we want Sarah since she's an archer, and we want lions. Definitely want Canopus. Uh, let's take Min since she's the best archer. Well, actually, uh, Gillen's pretty good. Well, let's see what else is... What are, what are their other differences? Uh, she's got better physical defense. Min's got slightly better magic, but that doesn't really matter. Okay. Um, who else do I want to take? Uh, let's take Grimoth, because uh, if I get any good cards... Uh, there's certain cards that I want for certain people. Um... Same with Lethal. And we'll take Bobo because of his spear. Oops. Alright. Well, let's hope we haven't chosen poorly. That's Nibus up there. Ah, welcome. I'm impressed that you made it this far. So, Mordoba is dead. Too bad. She was very helpful in my research and other things, too. Ugh. But why don't you forgive me? If you want me to apologize, I will do so. I'm of Gargaston blood, but I don't care who rules this island. I don't even care who wins. So why don't you let me go? You don't have to waste your time. So we can tell him to relax or tell him to shut up. Shut up, you evil magician! You disturb the souls of the dead. You're a disappointment. You cannot even begin to comprehend the truth. But then again, you are young. How can a lad who hasn't even lived a quarter century understand me? Too bad. I shall call demons from the depths of hell. Let's actually uh, see what he says for relax. Relax, I have no want to kill a weakling like you. But I will not set a criminal free, either. If you want to repay your dishonorable actions, then I will bring you to Amorica Castle. Good boy, I like you. You lead your people well. 
But I don't trust you. I know others are dying to kill me. Stupid fool. I shall call demons from the very depths of hell to destroy you. Hey! I offered to let you live! And now he's gonna summon some undead. This is why we wanted to take Donald along. There is, of course, another uh, um, ghost up there. Now show me, show me your deep attachment to life. <laughs> okay. Victory condition, kill the leader. Kill the leader, kill the leader. Me is a unique class, a necromancer. I do not believe you can get a necromancer. Alright, Vice and Leonard are probably going to rush straight up. Oh, hey, thanks for coming closer to us. Let me actually interrupt it. Ah, okay, well, Canopus is going to go first. Um, character list. Now let's see who we are facing. So, Nibus. Um, he has... Mind... A uh, mind ring, a ring made out of balder metal. Uh, weight plus one, intelligence plus five. And he is a necromancer, a magician who uses necromancy, extremely intelligent and mainly uses revive magic to bring back life into a dead body or creating a new life from the dead. Uh, nobody understands me. So he's got acid, calls acidic gas from the earth. Um, that's less than fun. He's also got incubus. And he's got Summon E, calls forth gremlins and undead characters. So he can bring new enemies into the battle. That's great. Target infinite. I'm not sure if it... It might be random where they appear. There's Luke the Ghost. I suppose we could have... There's a chance that we could have gotten uh, Luke and gotten his Incubus spell, but whatever. Not only are they complaining about the idea, now they are cussing about it. Uh, he actually would have been easier to get, probably. Um, got Kurt. Sometimes they express their complaints. It seems like you hit a nerve. Uh, oh, this one is Walstanian, and this one is Backroom. Interesting. Uh, we've got Dick the Skeleton! You could say he's got a real boner. Oh, I'm sorry, that was horrible. Uh, we got Little Joe the Soldier. Um, he is Gargaston. Uh, Malcolm the Soldier, also Gargaston. And that's about it. Alright, well, um... It might be best to try to get uh, Canopus up really high since I've given him a, uh, a bow. So this is one of the very, you know, really big downsides of this map, is that you are going uphill the whole way. Uh, luckily, they have no ranged... Oh, no, the the, ar the, the skeleton has uh, a ranged weapon. Alright, I believe we want to burn that tile, and there is something in the water actually right there. Alright, well... Uh, Donald, let's move you there. You're 26. That is n that it. Whoops. There's no way this is gonna hit. Nope. <sighs> you throw terribly. All right, Sarah. Let's head you up that way. This is very subdued, but uh, definitely ominous music. Yeah, I don't think so. It's worth a shot. Nibus is uh, actually coming down. I'm shocked. Uh, let's actually see what his... Uh, sometimes they express their complaints. It seems like he hit a nerve. Alright, that means that his loyalty is... Um, he's chaotic, so... Somewhere between 31 and 40. So that's, uh, unfortunate. But I think we will teleport him, try and teleport him up 
as well. He can also throw a stone, though, which is good. Alright, Bobo, uh, we'll get you right there. Get you in front of Ald, since you are higher level. Kashua is not going to do anything. Damn it, Kachua. And, of course, they're going right for me. Ow! Oh, God. At least there's only one archer. They don't seem like they like to throw stones very often. Although I'm actually a little worried about magic now. I gotta move uh, Alt back, I think. Alright, Gilwen, you cannot get into the water where I want you to, so... Let's move you there. I can move you in, uh... Next turn. Actually, let's see. 18, 15... 7, 8... Okay. We've got a few people moving it, uh, beforehand. Ah! Oh, God damn it! <sighs> Can't believe I just did that. Well, that's dumb. Alright, well, let's, uh... Let's have Grimmith attack, uh, Malcolm here. Gonna do a bit more damage. A whole lot more, but, uh... A bit. Uh, lethal cannot quite get in the rear, get into the, uh, behind the guy. Uh, but we can throw a stone. It's better than nothing. Voltel cannot, uh, get in there either. Let's go ahead and throw another stone. Uh, Vice is not going to do anything, but Kashua is going to heal me. Good. Um, not sure if that's enough healing. I'm gonna, I gotta pull back. Might have to put myself into a. Uh, uh oh. You gonna cast a spell on me? No. All right, going on, going for Bobo. It was taking a lot of damage, mostly because of me, my stupidity. I suppose I could heal up Bobo and then uh, move off with Ald. Uh -oh. Alright, well, my stupidity has gotten uh, one of our uh, characters killed, so... Yeah, the sleep is really gonna um, do it. Bobo fell asleep. I, I think I'm bleeding. I should never have joined the army. Yeah, alright, well... Good point to uh, end the episode anyway, and uh, I'll I'll restart it in the next one. Ah, making dumb mistakes. That's that's great. See you next time, everyone.